Hey everyone, I'm Sean. I'm an introvert who enjoys solo travel and now I'm organising and hosting a group of strangers for a winter adventure in Austria. I talked about why I wanted to do this in the previous episode but in short, I still do yearn for genuine connections with people even though socialising in general drains me. Also, I just wanted to get out of my comfort zone and do something crazy once in a while. So, the trip had a couple of problems. Did I mention winter adventure? Yup. We got green hills instead. Barely any snow while up in the mountain valley. I mean, just look at this ski slope. Snow has all melted. And this is the second part to the Austria winter adventure as we settle into our amazing cozy farm resort chalet and prepare for a fun-filled week. Good morning. Look what we have. Breakfast delivered in a basket. Good morning. Good morning. It's a bag of bread. Oh, we have yogurt with jam, a lot of condiments, fruits. And we have juices, apple juice, orange juice, and we have smoked salmon. Got a beautiful ham platter. Oh yes, some good news. It finally started snowing, turning the entire mountain valley into a winter wonderland. Perfect timing just before our three days of snowboarding here. Excited? Excited? We have snow today! Let's do this! Hey guys, enjoy yourselves! Wow, oh, I'm very nervous. You can do it. Okay, yeah, thank you. <laughs> all the best, all the best. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Let's go. Wow, oh, like sending off my children are there. <laughs> a bit, a bit. A bit, right? <laughs> First time. Wow. It just dumped powder in the morning. The snow today is so beautiful. Look at the view over there, the Austrian Alps. Man, it's been a year since I did this. I've been waiting for this day. Ah, you only get one chance a year to do this and I am so stoked to ride. Let's do this. <laughs> Not gonna lie guys, I'm terrible right now. <laughs> I forgot everything that I've learned. Back to square one. <laughs> Yo, this is it man. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Day one of snowboarding as much as I envisioned myself to be like this. It turned out a little bit different. Muscle memory all gone and I'm falling just like Tesla stock. And as much as I wanted to help guide the group on the slopes a little bit, I was just not cutting it. Help me. Oh my gosh, I'm so dead. (sighs) It also didn't help when I started to fall kind of sick. Not so good news. I'm feeling a bit feverish. Oh my gosh, I don't feel great. I am so wrecked. (sighs) Oh, what do I do? And to add on to the bad news, we had a minor injury from one of the explorers. Yikes. How are you feeling? Still surviving. So Jeff, enjoy his wrist. Oh, see. see. Oh yeah, it's so red. Oh my gosh. Okay, today go easy. Uh. Okay. Go easy. Don't sure. fall on your wrist. <laughs> and only by the third day, things started to feel a lot better. My body is wrecked. Billy and me. Alright guys, last day, best day. Are you guys ready? Yeah. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Last day, best day. <laughs> so we took the gondola up the mountain and whew, view of the Austrian Alps, spectacular. And what an amazing feeling to ride with such a view and to finally feel the flow in me. I 
lunchtime, having currywurst. Cheers, guys. It's been a long day. Yes. Well done, well done, well done, well done, well done. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Well done. I'm going to write the tea bar for the very first time. Um, this is only kind of present in European ski resorts, so this could very well end up in a disaster. <laughs> okay. <whew. laughs> And as we did our final descent together as a group, it just felt so heartening that everyone wanted to give their final best shot. Despite just learning the spot, overcoming their fears of the steeper slopes, and picking themselves up even after falling over and over again. Guten Morgen, good morning guys. So today is gonna to be a free and easy day. It's a chill day, still feeling wrecked. We are here at the beautiful, beautiful city of Innsbruck. It's got so much charm and character. Lots of beautiful, colorful houses lined up with the mountains as the backdrop. I'm loving the vibe of this city. So some of us took it to the streets and some went for the skies. at Swarovski's Crystal World. It's one of the more popular attractions here at Innsbruck. Highly rated. It's an exhibition and museum of all things bling bling. It's super cool, like lots of cool exhibitions here. Last day today, time flies, and we are doing alpaca hiking! Alpaca hiking! So cute! Carlos! Good! I swear, alpacas are the most derp looking creatures on earth. <laughs> Period. Yeah, I'm gonna adopt uh, an alpaca back home. Alpaca! Oh! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> like baby crying. Oh, okay, okay, sayang, sayang. Okay, oh, say, say. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, Ellie. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Man, what a beautiful day to just walk these cute creatures through the forest and the mountain valley with such a view. Even though I wished it would be covered in snow, but it still felt amazing. It's okay, Brownie. Oh, we just received some not so good news, bad news. Unfortunately, our epic 7km sledding toboganing has been cancelled because of bad snow conditions. There's no more snow on the hill. Totally no snow. Oh, that was something that I was looking forward to a lot. Oh, no more time, sledding. Yeah. Yeah. So, how are you guys feeling? No it's toboggan. It's okay, it's all about the company, it's fine. Wow. Ah. We're gonna do snow tubing instead. Leftovers on the counter Cage at the dead of fish And in the side is in the guest room Nice. Despite the disappointing change of plans, I am so glad the snow tubing turned out way more epic than I imagined it to be. And I think everyone definitely had a blast. And now, it is time for our final dinner at our farm chalet. Toast to everyone for putting yourself out there, going through snowboarding and conquering it. Everyone's very shocked, but you made it through. Toast to that. Yeah. Yeah. Toast to the Hendrik first. Next, we toast to Sean. Yeah. 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 The bread has been very well raved. Mm. The butter, so soothing. The bread is so soft and fragrant. So for our final dinner, we are having a um, traditional Tyrolean meal and uh, we are having a head meal. Uh, it's kind of a Austrian mokata <laughs> with the meat over here. They so pour the soup over the meat while it cooks on the spikes of the head. I just want to appreciate all of you all for being a part of this winter adventure. It's my first time hosting this, so it's very much out of my comfort zone. I also want to appreciate you all for going out of your comfort zone for doing this tour. Yeah, I love the vibes of everyone. This is pretty much like the perfect group for me. And cheers to more friendships, adventures, and of course, beyond the trip, after the trip, hopefully we still stay in contact. Cheers to that! Yay! So, my first ever community hosted trip has come to an end. I am so glad everyone had a great time, everyone connected very well together and were just so easygoing. Despite certain things not going according to plan like the lack of snow and the cancellation of our sledding activity. As an introvert, this was definitely draining as heck but I wouldn't have had it any other way. I guess my main challenge was really about coming out of my shell, trying to document as much as possible while still trying to stay present. Will I do this again? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. We'll just have to check in again. But this was definitely one heck of an adventure and I'm so glad I did this. <laughs> oh, 
Praise the Lord. Subscribe. 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 Subscrib